Hey there, it is Paige and you've joined me for weight loss tip number three and that is to read. You heard me right, I said read. Now what the heck does reading have to do with weight loss? Inspiration. That's right ladies, inspiration. I want you to go read stories, books, uh, blog posts about anyone that inspires you who have maybe achieved the goal that you wanted to achieve because if one person does it, anybody can do it, especially you. So I want you to read something that is inspiring for you, that helps you on your weight loss journey and living healthy journey. Now, I love to read cookbooks. I can sit on the couch all night and read cookbooks. I love it. I love flipping through the pages, looking at the pictures, and seeing what ingredients they're using. And it inspires me to cook different recipes, and they're all healthy, right? So I'm on my healthy journey. You could read spiritual texts from people such as Gabrielle Bernstein, Dr. Wayne Dyer, Marianne Williamson. There's many, many, many that uh, are on the shelf that are waiting for you to read. But read something that puts you in the right track, the right mental, physical, emotional vibration to go for your goals. And um, go to my website pagehinton.com. I have many articles, I have recipes, check it out, flip through it or scroll through it I should say and see what you like and see if there's an article there that just clicks with you and if it helps you let me know. So please leave a comment below and let me know if you're interested in this whole reading challenge and what you're gonna read. There are many blog posts all over the internet about eating healthy and from people who have achieved amazing results. Go out there and inspire yourself, inspire yourself, inspire yourself. And I hope you have a beautiful day. Please leave me a thumbs up if you like this message and subscribe below for more weight loss tips, yoga classes, and recipes. Have a beautiful day. Bye.